guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Crystal here, and today I'm going to be doing a makeup look. I'm going to be doing a purple eye because recently I did a green eye and I'll put it right here. I loved it so much and I was like, oh my gosh, I have to do a purple. So here I have all of my makeup products that I'm going to be using. And this is the eyeshadow palette I'm going to be using. It is the BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette and it has 35 colors. This is the palette. It's absolutely gorgeous. I don't know what purples I'm going to be using yet. I know there's a whole column for it. I'm probably going to be using the dark one and the light one. And then I might add like a little glitter to it. For like a glitter... A glitter um, eyeliner. So, I'm just going to get started. I would normally have my little table in front of me, but... It's downstairs in my nail studio. So if you see me looking to the side, I'm actually looking in my mirror since it is on my side. Okay, so I'm going to be starting with my Fenty Beauty Concealer. It is in the shade 450 as always. And I'm just going to take it and put it under my eyes. Then I take my um, Real Techniques Beauty Sponge and I just blend it in. I don't like to wet my sponge. Crap! Why didn't I do my eyebrows first? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do those after I finish blending. Oh my goodness. <laughs> So, lately I've been cooking a lot. I want to start a cooking segment on my channel. So if you have anything that you want me to cook, let me know and I will cook it. Uh, today for breakfast I made banana pancakes from scratch and they were so good. I'll insert a picture like here or something because they were so bomb. And it wasn't even, it didn't even take me that long. Like, I normally do my cooking set mix on Snapchat. I'm going to be using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Eyebrow Pencil. This is honestly, I think it's my second one and I've had it for like a year. Is that good? Like, is it supposed to last that long? I don't know. Maybe it's been like a year and a half and this is what it looks like. So these things last a really long time. pimple under my eyebrow and it's making it look like thicker than it is it's fine I'll just clean it all up with my concealer okay now I'm gonna be taking my Fenty Beauty concealer and just line it up Okay, now I'm taking my Real Perfection Concealer Brush. I need to wash my brushes, but I'm just going to blend out my concealer. Okay, yes ma'am. Also, if you see me looking over here, I have carrots because I was really hungry. So before I get started with my foundation, I'm going to go ahead and start on my eyes. So I'm going to take the concealer again, and I'm just going to put it on my lids. And I take my Mary Kay setting, setting powder, not spray, and I just... And this is what it looks like. Okay, it's fine. So next, I'm going to be taking my Take Me Back to Brazil palette. So I'm going to be taking the... Okay, I'm going to take this purple right here. 
Okay, I try to go from eyebrow tail to eyebrow tail, but this one is longer than this one, so I just estimate. So I'm taking that purple. Do y'all see that shape? Oh my goodness. So that's enough of that color so there's this purple right here that's right under it no actually I'm gonna take this one right here and I'm gonna put it on no okay I'm gonna take this one I'm gonna take that purple and I'm gonna put it in my crease <laughs> I'm gonna go back with the first brush I used and I'm just gonna blend out what I did right here. And now on to my lashes. This is the final like base colors. So now I'm gonna be taking my Soft Glam Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills and I'm gonna be using this shade Sultry. I'm gonna be using this color right here to create the winged liner and I'm going to be using my angled brush from Real Perfection. Yep. You can kind of see it. gonna do black because you can't really see it like we're just gonna look at this side i need to add more glitter don't get discouraged don't get discouraged <laughs> i'm done with that now i'm gonna go ahead my lashes are not in the box right now here these are the culture these are kiss naked drama collection this is what the thing looks like and then I have the lashes. So now I'm going to put them on. I definitely don't like it. <laughs> I should have just listened to myself and used the um the pink. But it's okay. It's not horrible. It's just not what I thought it was going to be. Okay, the lashes come with this tiny glue. So that's what I was just looking for. I could not find it, but it was literally in my face. I'm going to be taking my... I don't know where this... This is from Ulta. I just don't know the brand of it. Lash curler. And then I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Last Sensational Mascara. I only do like a light... A few light strokes of this. Okay, now I'll let it dry for a little bit. Of course they give me a hard time. I swear they only do this when I'm filming. Okay guys, so I just put it I just put the lash one on camera. That's it literally only gives me problems when I'm filming. So after I get it on, I like to take my lash curler and just push it down to my lash line okay and now i'm gonna go ahead and do the other one i will try to do it on camera so hopefully it works here we go 
It's being in a butt. It is being a butt. Okay, I think it's good. <laughs> it is still being a butt though. This lash is so much better. Oh. Okay, now I'm going to take my concealer and just clean up around here. Like the patches and stuff where the tape was. Okay, time to do my foundation. So I'm gonna be taking my MAC Pro Longwear Nourishing Waterproof Foundation as always. And I'm just gonna, ooh. Okay, I'm just gonna put it right here. That's a lot. So then I'm gonna take my foundation brush in my palette. Now that I have all that, I'm gonna be taking my my Real Techniques pound pound foundation brush, and I'm just gonna like. Blend it in circular motions. My Mary Kay translucent powder. I'm going to take in this beauty blender. on there longer than it normally is already so I'm just gonna wipe it away now it is time for my um contour I'm using the Lancome foundation is really dark I've said it before do a few little dots here I think that's everything. I'm just gonna finish it off with some powder. I'm gonna be using the MAC Studio Fix foundation powder and it is it's in the shade NW50. Blah blah blah. Oh, I've been like listening to, to Rihanna every single Every single day for the past like three or four days. So I'm using the Ulta Beauty Juice Infused, infused Lip Oil. <music> Gonna add some earrings, and that is everything. Your wife in the backseat, no brand new for don't know that you forgot. I call it shun shun shun. Oh my god. I don't have any more makeup wipes. And I just realized that. Okay guys. So this is the finished look. I will insert a video of me from Snapchat. Because I just feel like it looks better. Yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope you would try it yourself. Just to see your artistic abilities. And how much of an MUA you are yourself. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really love the way it turned out. Look at the eyes. Yes. Yes. Okay, like the shape, the precision, everything. I just love it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And comment video ideas and other makeup looks that you would like to see. And you can also DM or Snapchat me the looks. And, um, yeah. I love you. Bye.